hi guys want to see how i got my hair from this which is so dry and brittle to this which is super moisturized and soft watch this video hi guys welcome back to my channel it's your girl karma and if it's your first time here you're welcome subscribe to my channel click on the bell icon for you to get notified to upload a new video and to my three subscribers you're welcome so in today's video i'm going to show you guys this amazing deep conditioning treatment that is going to help you get a super moisturized hair and this is going to eliminate dry hair and dry and itchy scalp and this is just oatmeal for this i'm going to be using oatmeal for this treatment oatmeal is super good for the hair like this has benefit like tons of benefit to the hair so i'm going to show you guys how i prepare this particular deep conditioner and i'll be telling you guys the benefit of oatmeal and how i apply it on my hair so i measured that three tablespoon of oatmeal and I, I i then transferred it to my pot and i added one cup of water and when it comes to me using three tablespoon oatmeal tends to rise and i just want to use three tablespoon and even at that the gel that i got from it was still enough for my hair so i i just mix everything together both the water and the oats and i have other ingredients i'm going to add in this deep conditioner you can actually skip that part if you don't have those ingredients but those ingredients have to have another benefit to the hair and my first ingredient is going to be this which is the aloe vera i just cut my aloe vera into tiny pieces and added it to my pot and aloe vera has another benefit i love which is helps to moisturize your hair and condition the hair and i'm just so in love with aloe vera apart from its function and conditioning the hair aloe vera tends to help my hair to grow and i'm just like aloe vera fan like guys i'm just an aloe vera fan but if you don't have aloe vera you can actually skip this part and use only the oatmeal it's going to still give you a soft and a moisturized hair after using it on your hair so another ingredient i'm going to be using is ginger i'm using dry ginger that's why it's looking like that you can actually use the fresh ginger if you want and use the powder ginger too i love ginger because ginger helps to stimulate my scalp and help with blood circulation and i help with dandruff and itchy scalp and i'm just so in love with these three ingredients you can skip ginger if you want and if you have them you can actually use them and i love having these three ingredients and it's going to make your deep conditioner very very nice and it's going to deep condition your hair and it's going to grow and give you a soft hair so i'm just cooking my for a few minutes and i started turning stirring it together i was just stirring everything for it not to burn and i was i just cooked it for five minutes guys i just cooked it for five minutes for me to just get the gel ready so i let it to cool off because i'm just going to strain my oatmeal for me to get a smooth consistency from it and after it was cool i started to use my wig cap i call it i call this wig cap and people call it stocking cap or, any, or something like that but this is the, the cap i used to cover my hair before putting on my wig so i'm just using it for because it's going to give me it's going to get the gel out and it's not going to allow any particle to enter it why i'm going to be squeezing it out so uh i would advise you to use a strainer because using a strainer particles might get inside it and it might be so difficult for you to uh, get the gel if you're using a strainer like all these things called sieve so i prefer you to use something like this or a cloth or a cheesecloth too so i said to i said to squeeze everything out like this is so satisfying to watch like i was just squeezing the oatmeal for me to get the gel out and this consistency it gave me was so sweet and this consistency is going to allow easy application to my hair and it's going to be easy for me to rinse out after i'm done deep conditioning my hair so after i done squeezing everything out see i'm going to show you guys how it looks like after everything see how it looks like so i added my oil you can add any of your choice you can add only at this point you can add any essential oil but this doesn't have any smell for you to say that you need to add essential oil for you to mask the smell so guys this is my hair that i'm going to walk in with like my hair is so dry and brittle and my hair is so tangled up like my hair is so so tangled up so at this point i'm just going to use this deep conditioner to restore moisture to my hair because my hair felt so dry during the hammer time like my hair was so dry so i said to make this amazing deep conditioner to help my hair restore back its moisture or retain moisture again or be moisturized like i don't know i'm just using all the things i can get i can think of so i'm just going to be applying water on my hair just for me to loosen it up i like applying the conditioner on a damp hair my hair must not be drippy wet for it's just 
be a little bit damp then i'll then proceed to apply the water the deep conditioner in my hair and i'm just going to work in sessions guys like anytime i'm doing anytime i'm treating my hair with anything i work my hair with session even on wash days i work my hair with session because it enables me to ensure that all the strengths of my hair are well coated with whatever i'm applying on it so i'm just going to still apply water on my hair just to get it a little bit damp before applying my deep conditioner at this moment you can use any tea you have you can use black tea you can use green tea you can use your ayurvedic tea anything you want like it must not be water it must not be plain water and i'm even using warm water because i like working with warm water because i have low porosity and low porosity tends to is it, it's so difficult to retain water to retain moisture to the hairs and when you use warm water on your hair it's going to enable your hair follicles to open up and i just need that right now so i'm just going to be applying the deep conditioner starting from the ends of my hair to the roots of my hair and as i walk in i'll just start like i'll be working to, i'll be working it upwards for me to enable my hair is detangled and this deep conditioner gives, gave my hair a lot of sleep like guys my hair was so easy to detangle like with my finger and when i said to use the comb to detangle my hair my hair was already detangled using my hand to detangle it and i love the fact that this deep conditioner has sleep adding the added extra ingredient like aloe vera to condition my hair on it and when it comes to this deep conditioner you know i haven't told you guys the benefits of it i'm just going to i'm just going to list benefits of the deep conditioner to the hair when it comes to this deep conditioner it moisturizes and softens the hair which i've said earlier oatmeal has vitamin b that penetrates the hair shaft which allows our hair to retain moisture by acting like a human tant and it has sleep like a hard sleep by the ingredient that called gluten and as long as it keeps like as long as your hair is in a mask uh, your hair will feel so soft i'm going to explain why i said that so when it comes to strengthening oatmeal strengthens the hair oatmeal has more as allows the hair to be more elastic and it makes it stronger and less to breakage and uh, when least and uh, all these things leads to length retention because when your hair is strengthened to retain length easily understand when your hair is strengthening your hair tends to retain more length on it because it's going to cancel breakage like all this unnecessary breakage you'll be having so i'm just going to be detangling my hair first of all with my finger i'm just going to be doing finger detangling before i will then use my comb and at this moment guys my hair is so soft and so moisturized as in this thing really conditions my hair and when it comes to oatmeal oatmeal is like a scalp treatment for dry and irritated scalp if you are having a flame scalp maybe due to your yeah, too much itchiness and too much dandruff like your scalp feels so inflamed and like oatmeal tends to soothe the hair and enables your scalp to be healthy once again and i love this particular treatment because it's more applicable to the hair and to the scalp not all the conditioner you can apply on your scalp not all the conditioner is not advisable to apply all this store bought the conditioner to the scalp and when it comes to diy deep conditioner you can apply it both on your hair and your scalp and your hair will reap both the benefits of everything so guys this is my hair right now my hair feels so soft and detangled so i'm just going to cover my hair with my plastic bag the reason i say that if you your hair will feel so soft as far as it's it is kept in like a mask if you try to cover your if you try to leave this thing like a like a gel your hair will harden up like your hair will feel so stiff that's why it's not advisable to leave it as a gel like in short it's not good to leave it as a gel like air will pass through it your hair will feel so stiff so i'm just going to cover my hair with a plastic bag cover my hair with a scarf for it to penetrate and for it to just work it magic and after like 30 minutes i'll rinse it off thank you so much for watching this video and i'll see you guys in my next video subscribe to my channel bye